Dear friends, welcome to Culinary Hub. Today we present a flavorful, delicious gravy kofta curry with melt in your mouth mutton koftas. A dish that showcases nobility. The best part of the gravy is it has a balanced amount of spiciness and creaminess. We upload new videos every Saturday. Kindly subscribe to our channel and help the channel grow and don't forget to hit the bell icon. For the ingredients please check the description section. To get started with this flavor packed curry, first I'll chop the onion followed by chopping the garlic. Then I will powder a little amount of cashew nuts, fried gram and a little amount of dry coconut. Then I'll chop the tomatoes as fine as possible. I have already minced the mutton. Let me transfer it to a mixing bowl. Then I'll add finely chopped green chilies and coriander leaves. Then in goes the finely chopped garlic. I have strained almost all the water from the chopped onion. Let me add it to the mixing bowl. Then a bit of turmeric goes in. A little amount of garam masala powder. And salt as per taste. For binding, I'll be using the powdered fried gram. Then the cashews which are powdered, I'll add half the amount and retain the other half for the gravy. Then all these ingredients, I'll mix it thoroughly and start making the koftas. Every now and then, I'll be wetting the hands so that there are no cracks on the koftas. I have prepared all the koftas and it is ready for frying. I'll heat up a good amount of cooking oil and start placing the prepared koftas. I am frying it on a medium flame. Once the koftas are light brown in color, it is the time to take it out from the oil. In the same oil, I'll start frying the thinly sliced onion. I want the onion to be nice brown in color. Once the onion is nice brown in color, I'll take it out from the oil and keep it aside. Then in another pan, I'll be heating little amount of cooking oil, adding ginger and garlic paste, the finely chopped tomatoes, rather tomato puree. I'll fry it thoroughly. Then I'll be adding whole dry spices. Fry it for a minute. Then in goes red chilli powder, coriander seed powder, cumin seed powder, turmeric powder. Give it a mix. And then I'll add the fried onions by crushing it.
season it with little amount of salt then it is the time to add the powdered ingredients first i will add the powdered dry coconut then i'll be adding the retained cashew powder and fry it on a low flame so that the nuts releases enough amount of oil then i'll add a little amount of yogurt for creaminess then i'll be adding a little amount of water and it is the time to simmer the gravy till the oil gets collected on the surface i'll put the lid on and continue to simmer the gravy for 10 minutes after 10 minutes it is the time to check the consistency of the gravy and adjust it as per desire then it is the time to place the prepared koftas and simmer it for 15 minutes till the koftas soak up all the flavor from the gravy and become soft and succulent i'll be adding few green chilies and chopped coriander leaves and a little amount of lemon juice after 10 minutes of cooking and resting for another 10 minutes this is how the gravy looks i'll be garnishing it with little amount of fried onion and it is ready for serving thank you for watching this video please click the like button subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for the latest updates